forgive me if I look if I look a bit sick, but um, I am a bit sick. <coughs> Excuse me. So one would think that someone calling himself the atheist gamer would talk about atheism if not religion. But I hardly talked about religion at all. The closest thing I ever gone to talking about religion is going after homophobes on the internet. And well, it's kind of hard to combat homophobia when there's hardly any at all. I mean, like the only person that I know so far that's continually making YouTube videos against homosexuality and some other stuff that's related to religion is Theodore Schubert, along with um, what's his face, Caden Calger, G-Man, um, Brett Keen, and so on and so forth. Just, just, just naming a few. And I hardly talk about those people. I hardly talk about religion, and I am disappointed in myself because my entire channel was originally to go after uh, Christians, you know, mainly bigoted ones, and then there is the topic of video games, which I hardly talk about anyway. The closest thing that I ever talk about video games is when a social justice warrior attacks a certain video game for either being too racist, too sexist, you, you, name it, just name it, and they'll go after it. And never in my YouTube career, even as the Atheist Gamer 100, when I started ranting on YouTube legitimately, I have never once address Islam and I think now is the most appropriate time for me to talk about how fucked up Islam is. Yet the so-called religion of peace is possibly one of the most hateful and violent religions out there. Even the WBC has higher standards than Islam and it's one of the most racist and homophobic churches out there. <laughs> and to make the Westboro Baptist Church look humane really shows that you're fucked up in the head. I'll stop being around the bush and just get to the point. Criticizing Islam is not being Islamophobic. Saying that this religion, Islam, is one of the most hateful and vile things on this planet. Is not being Islamophobic. I've been criticizing religion even before I started criticizing feminism for years now. The only reason that I've stopped and barely mentioned about religion is because social justice, feminism is the it's the newest religion out there. Like, it's, it's not, no, not a religion, it's a fucking cult. You think that feminists would be against a religion that is okay with raping and murder. You think the feminists would speak out against it, but instead they remain silent and even go as far as defend these Islamics. Swift were complete opposite of the gen of, of, of the spectrum right here. Like he's a, a Christian, I'm an atheist. He's non-binary, I'm cisgender, and we both come up with the same conclusion that Islam is possibly one of the worst religions out there. And yet, social justice warriors defend Islam like if it's just you know them just expressing their beliefs. You know, them killing innocent people, that's just them expressing their beliefs. Them raping women, which by the way, they claim to be a fucking rape culture. They're silent about it. Zitch. None. Nothing. All because they fear that they might be called Islamophobic 
for daring to speak out against these people. <sighs> Look, I've criticized religion for years before the whole social justice outburst. And I should be able to criticize Islam because it's no different. It is a belief system and it should be held up to merit when confronted with evidence. When confronted with criticism. And yet these people, these Islamics, are willing to kill you if you dare spread blasphemy about their God. In the same sense that these social justice warriors are willing to dehumanize you for daring to speak out against feminism. And all you're doing is mansplaining. Listen, I'm not saying that every Islamic out there who follows the Quran is willing to kill someone just for disagreeing with their God. However, the Quran has a massive negative influence among a lot of Islamics. And these Islamics, the ones who are willing to kill in the name of God, has gone too fucking far. And they're still being under, under the protection of social justice warriors. This shit needs to end. I am the Atheist Gamer, and keep gaming on.